God, this is this is lovely. We should do this more often. Hello guys, welcome back to another episode of Simpcraft SMP. Today I'm here. Just my just my little Minecraft face. No no webcam today because I look worse than a drowned. Uh so yeah, we're just gonna keep it simple today. Uh I got lots to catch up on, done lots of bit on stream, lots of bits on stream. So yeah, let's have a little look around and then carry on our simping we okay so starting off with a quick tour of the area we now have a complete setup for potions what is going to be the beginning of our potion brewing for one of our shops for the upcoming shopping district uh cannot wait uh we've got we've done a little bit we've not got too much um we've got some extra ingredients to carry on crafting with but here we go this is our little station then let me just hop over here and we have our cooking area I have smokers, I have blast furnaces, I have normal furnaces, and I have a couple of little tools down here. This is our just operations, daily, you know, ooh, some chicken, nice. Ooh, bit of steak, lovely. Anything in here that I forgot? No, nice, okay, cool. Well, this is where we are cooking and spending most of our time uh, smelting stuff. And then over to our right, no, not, not, not you, Kiwi. Uh, over here, we have our new and improved storage area. Wow, look at it, it's so pretty. There's loads of chests with stuff in it. Secret stuff, uh, not so secret stuff. Uh, we have we have all kinds of bits here. Uh, I have the, in here, we, this is our, This is my preparing for battle chest. This is all my, my armor, my diamond armor, my sword. Got some pretty good. I've got an enchanted golden apple here that I found in on stream. Uh, so yeah, we're pretty we're pretty geared up. We've got lots of lots of redstone resources that we're gonna need today. We're gonna do some redstone in today. I'm not very good at redstone, but we are gonna try. Probably fail, but we're gonna try. Speaking of redstone, let me show you what else I've done. And here we are on our little little sand island. Our little our little whatever this is. It looks horrible. There's netherrack in the floor as well. Thanks. Thanks a bunch, ghost. You did that. You made it look ugly. Anyway, this is uh, this is where we've built a couple of little redstone machines. Nothing too fancy. Very simple stuff. I've got a lot to learn. Um, but we've just got some sugar cane going on here. Oh, two stacks. Nice. Um, just to get us, you know, some sweet sugar. And uh, then over here, we've got the much needed watermelon farm. Oh, lovely. Uh, and the pumpkin farm, which is doing pretty good. Pretty good. I'm having some issues with... Uh, when it when it breaks the melon and pumpkin blocks, they stay up here for some reason. I think I have to use switch this for maybe a um, hopper in a minecart system thing. I don't know. I don't know how it works. Uh, and then it can pick up through because it can't pick up through whole blocks apparently, but it can pick up through tilled blocks. But these until every time something grows. So yeah, got to fix that. You might also notice that over here. Oh, whoops. Over here, it's looking it's looking pretty quiet because sadly we has we had a casualty. I don't know what happened to him, but Francis is gone. He he's he's left this realm, uh, so I've had to maintain his farm in his stead. Uh, hopefully one day he returns. If not, maybe we'll get one of his relatives. But for now, big sad. Francis left us. He 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 go bye bye. Heading over to our to our, the the beginning of our build that is now finished the boathouse. Uh, you can see I've cleared out a lot of the forest. Goes far back. It's very open, ready for us to start building our amazing, amazing Hogwarts castle replica. Cannot wait. Uh, I've started the stairs. This isn't just a grotesque uh, cobblestone growth thing coming out of the ground. This is the famous staircase that comes out of the back of the boathouse and then leads up towards Hogwarts. Ha ah, Hogwarts. Um, this is just the beginning of it. I put this down just so I could kind of map it out in my head. Uh, obviously this isn't floating. I do have to build this into a mountain or build a mountain into this. Um, so this will be coming out. It will be mostly stone and stuff from what I can remember. So yeah, uh, and this is this is our finished. Let me just let me jump in a boat and show you the front of it. Ta-da! Look at that through through the sun glare. You can see. Oh, let me. What way am I going? This way. Through the sun glare, you can see the magnificent finished build of our boathouse, all open and lit up. The tower on top. We did all this on stream. Uh, it looks great. Well, I, I don't know if I finished it in the last video. I can't remember. My memory is shot. I am a melon after all. My head is full of juice. 
but yeah, this is all finished, all inside, it's decorated. We've got the beams going across, we've got light coming through and the windows up there. We've got a nice little painting donated to us by the the lovely queen that is ghosty. Oh, we we simp over her a lot for this painting. Um, and yeah, this is this is looking good. Uh, got plenty of boats in here. I'm really happy with it. I'm really pleased. We've got these grand windows here. I, I love it. I'm super pleased with it. Got the hidden door in the glass that, funnily enough, a lot of people haven't noticed. So yeah, and we've obviously got the growth and then the window up there for some decoration. I think it looks really good. Like I say, I'm not a builder either. I'm kind of just a general survival player of Minecraft, so builds or redstone aren't my strong suit. But this I'm super proud of. I think it's quite close to the um, actual boathouse. I think it's our sort of representation of it. And I'm super happy. I'm super proud. Yeah. So our main bit of business today is going to be setting up a wool farm. Wool? Is that how you say it? I can't say wool for some reason. Stupid accent. Um, because our next, the next part of our build is going to be the infamous Quidditch pitch. And for that we need a lot of wool for all the towers, for all the decorations and all the colours. And for a lot of other stuff in our build we're going to need lots of wool. And I... I well, you cut. You can see uh, something I'm lacking in my farm right now. I've got, I've got chickens. I've got cows. I've got some horses down there. I do not have any sheep. So, first order of business is go and find some sheep for what will be our automatic wool farm. I have some leads here. We're going to use those and some. Uh, what do you call it? The stuff that they eat. Wheat. That's the one I'm looking for. Wheat. Yeah, wheat. Uh, and we're going to go and find some sheep, and then we're going to drag them back here. Uh, tie them up, keep them hostage, and then force them into a chamber to forever give us wool for all eternity. So I'm pretty certain now in this direction, in the past, I have seen... Oh, we should pick these up for... Gimme, 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 gimme. Gimme the flowers. Gimme. God, I'm so easily distracted. But this will be good for dye, but we need it. We'll definitely need red. Don't know about purple, though. Um, I'm pretty sure out this way... I have seen sheep before. I have been having issues with um, passive mobs spawning near my base. They just kind of, they just kind of don't want to come near me. I don't know why. You know, maybe it's something to do with the fact that I tend to kill every innocent animal that comes near me. I don't know, but yeah, they just don't seem to want to be be my friend and be locked up in a wool farm for eternity. Who knows? Hmm. This could be kind of a problem. Ah, uh, we'll leave it for now. Stupid lava. You're not a sheep. Yeah, you leave. Hmm. You're also not a sheep. Excuse me, sir. Have you have you seen any sheep around here? You have? Oh, oh god. Oh, sorry. Sorry. Sorry that I asked about sheep. Oh, sorry. Jeez. So I finally found sheep. Which is great. You know, I found loads of sheep, in fact. Loads of sheep. There's even some more over there. Um... The reason I'm not too happy about this is because I had to, I had to cross an ocean to get here. So bringing them back to base is not going to be fun, but we're going to have to do it. So let's go. So I've decided just to leash, leash these three up, and then hopefully they kind of just follow me back across the ocean. And the leashes don't break. If not, I have the wheat to kind of coax them. Um, I think three sheep is going to have to do for now. Land ho! It's there. We're so close. They're still there. I can see the leashes. They're attached. Oh, this is a tale of epic proportions. One melon alone dragging three sheep across the ocean. Actually, it wasn't that far, but you know. We can we carry on. Okay, let's go, ladies. Let's go. Don't get stuck on a block now. Oh, for God's sake! Come on, this way. Ow! Let's put those there. Kill this guy. We actually successfully did it. <gasps> no, you didn't. You will die, bastard! Die. Okay, we've got our sheep. We have successfully got wrangled three sheep, which is great. You know, we can um, we can breed them and get a few more. I think maybe we'll need, what do we need? Uh, red, green, yellow, black, white, blue. Uh, I think that's pretty much it. 
I think that's pretty much it. We don't need any pink, really. Don't need any purples. Maybe some like other shades of blue, red, green, yellow, all those kind of ones. Um, but yeah, uh, we'll, we'll make these and then we'll start on our redstone machine. Okay, here we have it, guys. Our sheep are in. You can see this guy's already been sheared. Look at him, his little naked bum. He's already been sheared, so it's definitely working. I kind of want to watch these two just so you can see. Uh, eat. Eat. Do the eats. Get sheared. <gasps> oh my god, this one grew up and then got sheared instantly. <gasps> Let's go check. Let's go look. We got twelve. We got twelve already, just from five sheep. That's crazy. Any more? Come on, eat, please. I'm not sure if I'm gonna na have to name these guys. Uh, hopefully they don't despawn. If they do, I'll be a big sad. They should do though. They should not do. Um, come on, just eat. Let me show everyone. Let me show everyone that you get sheared. Come on, you know you want to. Oh, I also put this little dirt uh, bridge here just to make it easier to go across. I'll probably turn it into a pathway once it's done. Um, just so you know, it looks cool. And then I'll build it up and make it like my little access. Uh, oh, I've also done this as well. So it looks a bit neater around here just for my access to the chest. So yeah, there we go. Our little wool farm has been built. We've got a wool farm, we've got a sugarcane farm, we've got a heckin' pumpkin farm and watermelon farm that still isn't working properly, but I've got to figure it out. Uh, and yeah, I think that's going to do it for this episode, guys. That was a lot. That was a lot for my small brain. My, my small, small brain. Uh, thank you very much for watching and bearing with me while I don't have a face cam. It means a lot. Oh, oh my god, it works. Quick, before we go. Uh, 13 a it were thanks buddy thanks buddy uh, so yeah thank you thank you very much for watching guys I really appreciate it it's coming along on the simpcraft server we're able to do more the sheep are being sheared left right and center look at them all naked oh it's going well glorious days uh, I think we're gonna be able to start on our little project aka building the Quidditch pitch soon um, stay tuned for that I'm gonna be doing a lot of wool uh, farming and stuff on stream and changing color and doing all the dyes and stuff on stream so if you want to check that out make sure to click the link in the description to the stream i do a lot of uh in between stuff on the during the stream like collecting resources and not getting killed by those guys oh god they're coming for me they're coming for me i got to end quick guys make sure to like subscribe and everything uh pray for my life if you if you if you don't subscribe and like this video now uh those guys over there are going to kill all my sheep so unless you're cold and heartless make sure make sure to do it do it do it do it thank you for watching bye 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 <laughs>